and today I'm going to share with you a recipe that is near and dear to my heart. I first tried this recipe many years ago when I was a teenager and it was such a hit. So I'm going to share it with you today. We're going to be making cheese biscuits. This savory treat is so delicious. It is a perfect snack for children and you can also use it as a base for an appetizer. But before I go over the ingredients, I just wanted to say thank you to some of you who have been sending me the recipes that you have been trying. So I'm going to post some of those pictures now. So special thank you to Marcel for her lovely dish. Over here we have Marilyn. It looks amazing. We also have another dish from Natalie. I want to encourage you to keep trying these recipes and send the pictures to me at the end of this month. There may be something special for you, so I encourage all of you, try your recipes, send me the pictures, I'm gonna post them here on my channel and also on my IG page. And an extra special shout out to Lisa. You have been sending me all of your recipes and I have absolutely been loving them. There is definitely something special coming your way. Now, let's go over the ingredients. We have 100 grams of cheddar cheese. Now you can use any kind of cheese that you have, Today I'm using cheddar, 70 grams of all-purpose flour, 50 grams of softened butter, one pinch or one eighth teaspoon of salt because the cheese could be salty, quarter teaspoon of paprika and a quarter teaspoon of granulated garlic or just garlic powder. Now this recipe is really simple. As you can see, there are few ingredients. So I'm gonna encourage you to go ahead and preheat your oven now to 250 degrees and we'll start to put our cheese biscuits together. Okay, the first step, we're gonna prepare the cheese. So I'm gonna add the cheese and the softened butter together. Now the ingredients we have here will be enough to make about 20 cheese biscuits. If you wanna make more than that, be sure to increase your ingredients proportionately. Now I'm gonna use a handheld mixer and we're gonna mix the cheese and the butter together. Now this is finished, we're gonna set this aside and we're gonna prepare our flour. So we're gonna just add the salt, garlic, and paprika to our flour. Gonna use a mini whisk and stir everything so it's fully combined. Then we're going to add our flour to the cheese. Now we're going to just use a spatula to make sure we have the cheese and the butter mixture into the center. Then we're going to add the flour. And it's at this point that we get our hands all dirty because we're going to make a nice dough. Make sure we squeeze it to make sure that it stays together then we're gonna put it onto a floured board or a counter as we prepare to roll it you can add one teaspoon of water just to help it to come together no more than one teaspoon remember we don't want our mixture to be wet and it will have the moisture already from the butter. We'll gently knead the dough in the bowl at this time. We're gonna be squeezing, pushing against the base of your hand until we get all the contents of the bowl into a nice shape. Mm -hmm. Now we have our nice little ball. We have to be careful as we do it. We're gonna get the rolling pin and we're gonna roll it out. And then we're going to get our cookie cutter and we're going to cut it into some small circles. Are now ready for the oven. I'm gonna just put a prick in them 
just to make it look all official. Now we're gonna bake them for eight to 10 minutes, no more. Our cheese biscuits are now done. I would have removed them from the oven a few moments ago, allow them to cool. And remember I said you can use them either as a snack or as part of an appetizer. These are so delicious. They bring back such wonderful memories for me. Now it's time to taste. I think I'm gonna try the one that you can use as an appetizer. Now you can choose any topping that you want. The base is a cheese biscuit and you can put any topping. Two bites and it's over. delicious literally the perfect bite cheese biscuits now you need to try it now if you enjoyed this cheese biscuits recipe you need to check out my other appetizer recipes over here and once you've watched them go ahead and click the button that will fall below subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video and remember to leave a comment I love hearing from you